Stephen Fry has confirmed he has been diagnosed with prostate cancer. Sharing a 12-minute video on his personal blog today, the 60-year-old explained he has been missing from the public eye because he's been fighting for his health. For the last two months I've been in the throes of a rather unwelcome and unexpected adventure. I'm sorry I haven't felt able to talk about it till now, but here I am explaining what has been going on, said the star, who was forced to step down as the BAFTA's 1028 host after 12 years. Explaining the disease was discovered after he visited Dr. Aflu Jab, he said blood tests from a health mo revealed a raised level prostate specific antigen PSA. It was not very high to be perfectly honest, he said, explaining that someone 10 years older would expect 5 as the mean level. Admitting he wasn't particularly concerned and that he didn't really even know what a prostate was he only agreed have MRI to keep his doctor happy. But after undergoing the test, he received a call from his doctor the very next day, informing him that something rather mischievous showed up. At that point he was referred a specialist who ordered a transrectal biopsy. It's not an experience I would recommend to my worst enemy, it was really rather unpleasant feeling, like taking ice core in the poles, he said. They then went through his options, with radiation and complete removal of the prostate both on the table, and in January he underwent surgery. He also had 11 lymph nodes removed and his cancer was found to be more aggressive than originally thought. It takes longer than you might like and all rather undignified. Thanking family and darling husband, he said he's struggling to come terms with the phrase, I've got cancer.